Oh my god, I can't believe I'm filming my outro in a bikini. This is definitely a first for my channel. Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Nicole Hughesman and thank you so much for clicking on this video. Today I'm super excited to show you all my Abercrombie & Fitch haul, which has recently become one of my favorite brands. I loved it in middle school and then I think I tried to like block out those bad memories. So I didn't think to continue shopping in the brand, but in the last year or so, I've really been impressed with their quality for their price and how cute their stuff is. So this is actually part one of my Abercrombie & Fitch haul because the orders came separately. So I'll be doing part one today and then maybe next week or the week after, depending on when the shipment comes in, I'll be doing my Abercrombie & Fitch haul part two. So without further ado, let's try all these gorgeous clothes on. This is seriously one of the cutest tops I have ever put on. I think it's so flattering for my body shape. I love that there's a bit of a neckline without it being just too plunging. I am wearing a bra, which I think I would wear like a strapless bra with this, but I just think it's so cute. These are actually lemons. It's like a little, instead of florals, it's like a lemon print and the top comes down to about here. And I just think it is so darling. I'll show y'all the back. And I will absolutely be keeping this top. I'm not sure I love this skirt. I think maybe it's just the overlappingness of the fabric. I wish there was more definition around my waist. So maybe if this was like kind of rolled up a little and this was rolled down a little almost, but I just don't think it's the most flattering for my body shape. I am like mid to larger size, so not everything works for me, but I do love the print and I think it's just, it is a cute flouncy skirt. I love that it kind of looks like a dress when it's all together, but I think I'm not gonna keep the skirt because it's such a statement piece. I don't think I could wear it as often as a white skirt or a non-patterned skirt. So I don't know, now that I see it in the viewfinder though, it is super darling. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna have to think on it. Definitely keeping the top and debating the skirt. So this is the next outfit. It is this adorable dress that has this like faux kind of wrap, but it is secured and I'll pull my hair back so you can see it has this cool like square 90s neckline. And I love the shape of this dress, but something about the color makes me feel like I'm wearing a pattern or <laughs> like an unfinished garment. Like I feel like it almost looks like a starter garment that you would then use to create other pieces. And it's super cute. I love the shape. I love this like detail here and the way that comes together, but I'm just not sold on the fabric. So I think I might try and see if I can't get this in another pattern. But last time I checked, they were like sold out of all the other <laughs> patterns of this dress. Um, and again, I love, love, love this shape. So I almost wonder if I could like dye it myself or do something interesting to it because the shape is really, really flattering. It's just, I don't know, maybe it's not showing up on camera, but in my mirror, it just looks like someone forgot to paint the garment. <laughs> this next outfit I just paired with the lemon top from earlier, and it is this tie, fake tie wrap skirt. And I'm kind of having the same issue with this one as I did the last one. It feels not like a finished garment. I'm not a huge fan of the length on me. I wish it was just like a tiny bit shorter. I love this wrap detail. It's not, maybe I should have gone down a size because there is quite a bit of room. I got the large and almost everything except for the swimwear, which I did extra large on the top. And yeah, it's a cute skirt, but it's nothing that I, I don't think I would keep this in my closet. It's just hard because this piece, this top is just so stunning that it's really setting the bar for the other pieces. Oh my goodness, how cute is this bikini? This is like, I, I love that lemon top. This is easily my favorite thing from this entire haul. I love the ruffle on these sleeves. I love this print. It looks floral, but it's actually peaches. I love how it's supportive and it makes my boobs look really voluminous. The only thing I will say, I got the largest size, which is an extra large, and I still kind of feel like I'm spilling out a little bit, um, but you know, you can't win them all. Not everything's gonna be perfect. This sarong is also with that same peach print. And then underneath, I'm just wearing the like regular waisted cheeky bottoms with it. And I think this is such a cute like resort look. I am so excited to wear this in the summer. This will definitely be the first bikini I reach for. And I 
love this so much <laughs> that between clips i actually went back online and ordered a bunch more bikinis from abercrombie and fish because i couldn't get over how good the quality of this is i actually loved it so much and i couldn't pick tops so i have this ruffle top and i also have this one which i'll go try on now because i couldn't decide which one i liked better so this is the other top it kind of has this cool like it almost has like a strapless bra underneath but then it has these straps to hold it up and i feel a little bit more supported in this i'm not sure which one i like better i can't oh they're both super cute i'll show you the back it's kind of the same back but i feel like this one is a little bit more conservative whereas the other one is very very booby so leave a comment down below telling me which one you like better because i cannot decide which one to keep oh my god i can't believe i'm filming my outro in a bikini this is definitely a first for my channel well, thank you so much for watching my Abercrombie and Fitch haul part one. If you liked what you saw, uh, there will be a part two and I have more swimwear coming and I think more dresses. So if you want to see that, like this video so I know you like this kind of content. Subscribe to my channel to see more and turn on that bell icon so you get notified every time I upload a new video, which I try to on every Thursday. So I really hope you like this and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye.